Welcome to our channel The Healing Spell. Today's video is on vitamin B2, also called riboflavin. Let's see the functions of vitamin B2 that is riboflavin in our body. It acts as a cofactor for energy production from carbohydrates, fats and proteins. It plays an essential role in cellular function, growth and development. It is required for oxygen utilization in the body. Also, riboflavin has a role in vitamin A, vitamin B3, vitamin B6 and vitamin B9 production and function and also required for processing iron in the body. It has a key role in development and functioning of skin, lining of digestive tract, blood cells, vital organs and eye health. Also, vitamin B2 is required for antioxidant glutathione production. Riboflavin has a positive association with childbirth weight and length. Few studies also relate or connect migraine episodes to riboflavin deficiency and there are also reports suggesting that riboflavin can prevent DNA damage and prevent cancer. Our intestinal bacteria also produce a substantial amount of vitamin B2 depending on the type of food we eat. Since more amounts of vitamin B2 are present in meat-based diet, if one is particularly on vegetable-based food, then more amounts of vitamin B2 are produced by the intestinal bacteria. The daily requirements of riboflavin for various age groups is as follows. Deficiency signs and symptoms of riboflavin is called A-riboflavinosis and it includes skin disorders, edema or swelling of the mouth and throat, angular stomatitis or cracks around the corner of the mouth, Chelosis or swollen cracked lips, hair loss, reproductive problems, itchy red eyes, degeneration of liver and nervous system, anemia, cataract and symptoms of deficiency of vitamins dependent on vitamin B2 like vitamin A, B3, B6, B9 and iron. Also, deficiency during pregnancy can cause birth defects, especially in the heart. Riboflavin deficiency can also be seen in people with hypothyroidism or intestinal infections, diseases, etc. Riboflavin deficiency is common in vegans as meat and dairy are rich sources of vitamin B2. Coming to overdose of vitamin B2 or riboflavin, there are no reports of riboflavin toxicity mainly because it is water soluble and excess is removed through kidney via urine. But it is always better to limit one's intake especially in tablet forms. Relying on natural sources of vitamins is always the best. Coming to the dietary sources of vitamin B2, most cereals and fruit drinks in many countries are fortified with vitamin B2. You will see the details on their packages. Coming to food sources, first meat sources 100 grams each of lamb liver provides 4.6 milligrams of riboflavin beef liver 3.4 milligrams cooked beef 0.4 milligrams cooked lamb 0.3 milligrams cooked chicken turkey duck etc 0.2 milligrams 100 gram servings of fish like cooked cuttlefish 1.7 mg, cooked raw fish 0.9 mg, king mackerel fish 0.6 mg, cooked oysters, clams, squids etc. 0.4 mg, salmon, tuna fish, crab provide 0.2 mg. Coming to dairy and eggs, 100 grams each of goat cheese has around 1.2 milligrams of riboflavin, raw egg yolk 0.5 milligrams, hard boiled eggs 0.5 milligrams, egg white 0.4 milligrams, 
शेडा पार्मेसान और मॉर्जरेला चीज 0.4 मिलीग्राम कंडेंस्ड मिल्क 0.4 मिलीग्राम होल फैट मिल्क 0.3 मिलीग्राम योगर्ट 0.3 मिलीग्राम पनीर और कॉटेज चीज 0.3 मिलीग्राम बटर मिल्क 0.2 मिलीग्राम बटर 0.1 मिलीग्राम बीन्स एंड लेंटिल्स 100 ग्राम ईच of soybean around 0.3 mg cooked black eyed peas peanuts broad beans moong beans cooked lentils kidney beans chickpeas split peas lima beans etc all contain around 0.1 mg of riboflavin grains and pasta rice bran 0.3 mg oat bran 0.3 mg uncooked corn meal 0.2 mg quinoa cooked 0.1 mg whole wheat pasta 0.1 mg brown rice 0.1 mg nuts and seed sources 100 g each of almonds provide 1 mg of riboflavin sunflower seeds 0.4 mg sesame seeds 0.3 mg pistachios 0.2 mg pine nuts 0.2 mg cashew nuts 0.2 mg chia seeds pumpkin seeds walnuts etc 1.2 mg hazelnut 0.1 mg dried coconut 0.1 mg vegetable sources 100 g each of sun dried tomatoes 0.5 mg white button mushrooms 0.5 mg cooked beetroot greens 0.3 mg kidney bean sprouts 0.3 mg cooked spinach soybean sprouts cilantro pea sprouts and other green leafy vegetables provide around 0.2 mg of riboflavin cooked green peas cooked broccoli malabar spinach moong bean sprouts garlic red bell pepper cooked sweet potatoes etc provide around 0.1 mg of riboflavin coming to the fruit sources 100 g each of dried peaches and golden raisins provide around 0.2 mg of riboflavin dried prunes 0.2 mg avocado 0.1 mg apples passion fruit custard apple bananas dates grapes litchi prickly pears jack fruits pomegranate figs all of these contain 0.1 mg of riboflavin per 100 g of fruit spices and herb sources 100 g each of dried parsley provides around 2.4 mg dried coriander leaves 1.5 mg dried basil 1.2 mg dried oregano 0.5 mg dried rosemary 0.4 mg bay leaves caraway seeds fenugreek seeds fennel all contain 0.4 mg dill leaves 0.3 mg coriander seeds mustard seeds cloves black pepper cardamom all of these contain 0.2 mg of riboflavin per 100 g Our next video will be on vitamin B3 or niacin. Please like, share and subscribe to our channel and don't forget to click the bell icon for notifications. See you all soon. Till then, take care and always stay happy and healthy. Bye.